Psychosomatische Medizin will... Psychosomatic medicine aims to recognize, understand and treat the relationship between the mental health and the physical conditions of patients. And here, at Germany's oldest university hospital for psychosomatic medicine, we have been doing this since 1950, embedded within a large university hospital. Heidelberg Psychosomatic Medicine is to a degree a role model for German psychosomatic medicine as a whole. Expertise in psychosocial medicine within psychotherapy on the one hand and integration in psychosomatic medicine on the other hand. And there are many people who wondered, is this a special way we don't actually need? But the last few years in particular have shown that this special profile is very important for the numerous people who, in their treatment, would fall through the gaps between somatic medicine on the one hand and purely psychological medicine on the other. Research plays a very important role here at our hospital and the results are then also incorporated back in the treatment of our patients. As an example, our hospital, together with other university hospitals, conducted the ANTOP study. It examined to what degree anorexic patients benefit from outpatient psychotherapy and also from what type of treatment. The Cognitive Behavioural Therapy Group showed a more rapid weight gain. The focal psychodynamic therapy group, however, was able to maintain their weight for a long time in the subsequent examinations and even extend their weight gain after the end of the study. Our hospital is one of only a few in Germany which are integrated in a centre for psychosocial medicine, but also in a university hospital for internal medicine like this one. To us, the somatic sessions are an essential component because we don't know exactly what some symptoms are caused by. Tiredness may have a physical cause or it could have a psychological cause. A simultaneous diagnosis from both sides, physical and mental health, form the basis of an individual diagnosis and that in turn forms the basis of a personalised treatment plan, which enables us to treat the patient in his illness in the best possible way before and after. The German National Centre for Tumour Diseases in Heidelberg combines cutting-edge top-class medicine, patient care, with innovative cancer research under one roof. The aim is to transfer the latest research findings into patient care as quickly as possible. The psycho-oncological care forms a central and integral part of the oncological care, because in spite of longer survival times, in spite of improved treatment options, the patients are often confronted with numerous burdens, lots of worries and fears. In Deutschland is it so that... In Germany, psychosomatic medicine and psychotherapy is a separate field, with its own specialist training independent of psychiatry. Looking into the future, we are particularly committed to teaching and training the next generation of doctors. All our students have to undergo communication and discussion skills training because we believe that a good patient-doctor relationship is an essential precondition to enable patients to make the right treatment decision for themselves. We want better treatment to get through to the patient and in order to do that we are redeveloping and evaluating our treatment methods and showing that they are really effective. In fundamental research, we want to see how, for example, life events like stress and trauma interrelate down to the molecular level and the cell level with findings, which we want to depict in a biopsychosocial continuum. Darüber hinaus ist die moderne Medizin eine High-Tech-Medizin, die zunehmend komplexer wird. Dabei ist es notwendig, dass die jungen Ärzte... And we also want to teach all these processes to our medical students. High-Tech medicine will become more and more complex, and the young doctors need to learn to communicate well with their patients and also to choose the right diagnostic methods and treatment options and to make these decisions together with their patients. And we are convinced that the future of medicine will be in psychosomatics. <laughs> <laughs>